the Celtics. Folks, here is the starting lineup for the visiting Hawks. There we go. That's all I need to see at the four. Rando is a playmaking sharp shooter. Jay a full at a pure lockdown at the two. Arsenal still a pure glass. That boy shots is a shot creating post score. What year is this? Shots. See what he's going to do with this post score. And nobody's had to guard any sort of post defense. So it's just going to be intriguing to see. And the post score. Well, we're about to find out. A little bit different when you get on stage. And he works. No autograph. Can't finish. Arsenal right there for the board. And the big thing, too, is that no autographs. He's not on the rim protector either. So, I mean, Shots is going to be able to spin out of the post a lot. You're going to see that. In the passing lane. He's on the break. Now with Atlanta. Shots on that cold ring. That ain't gonna do it. That's a lot of that obviously anybody who uses it in the retail version of the game, you see how easy you can get some spin-offs. I mean, there's like one person I know use it, a guy named Blaze, and that's it, me! The that's me! Why the am I not there? Why am I not there? That's the stupid! That's stupid! I hate this game! I hate this game! Do you need a Stag 2K19 or Fortnite account? If you do, make sure you hit up that game with a plug on Twitter. He sells anything that your heart desires. Max badges, high overalls, even 99 overalls. And make sure you let him know that Blaze sent you. Hey, 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 it's Blaze, and today I'm going to be talking about just a few things getting on my chest. If you haven't already, drop a like, subscribe down below if you are new, and welcome to my channel. FYI, my Twitch is in the description. Very soon, I'll get moving to Twitch and live streaming there. So, if you enjoy the park live streams, prime live streams, make sure you tune in and follow my Twitch in the description. Um, also look it up. It's Blaze 2K20. Blaze 2K20. That's where it's gonna be. Now for the first topic. That boy shots. That boy bricks. That boy is trash. That boy is garbage. That boy is a sellout. He tried bringing my build. A shot post into 2K League. He couldn't even score on a slash and stretch four. I repeat that. He could not score on a slashing stretch four. And you saw what happened. He went three for 11. Well, technically, he went one for two from three. So he's t technically, he's two for 10 in post ISO. 2 for 10 in post ISO, 4 rebounds, 4 assists, and 5 steals. I don't know how he had 5, that's pretty good, 5 steals from shot post, that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, 2, two, for, two for 10 in ISO, that's, that's just, that's terrible. Terry Blay. Um, and I just want to get off my chest that I, with all of the work that I've put in and what I have been doing on the court, it's really frustrating when I see a 2K League player try to pick up my build, be completely garbage at it, and then like just bring a whole entire shame to the post score name. If somebody brought a post score out there and was dominant as f he would be a beast, I would be proud of that. Then I approached him on Twitter asking him, hey, I will give you some advice. I will coach you up. Hire me as an assistant coach. Let me train him. Let me teach him how to facilitate. Let me bring you some plays. What happens? He blocks me on Twitter. He blocks me on Twitter and then gets into a fight because that is how bad he played. He got, he got into a fight and pushed a top player in the 2K League. Out of that frustration by doing no combos now next thing I want to talk about is how to run a five out of a post score this is something that I've been experimenting with 
That's kind of a flashback to 2K18, but I'm trying to see if it implements into 2K19. And so far, it's been working pretty well. I'm um, teaming them pretty well. We were number one in WR for quite some time. Um, but some teams did catch up to us, and now we're fighting for one, the number one spot. Um, so we'll see what happens. But the meta of the 5 level post score, if the post score knows what he's doing, is going to be a very OP lineup, especially if he gets implemented to 2k league, and I'll tell you why. You can have two lockdowns, two stretches, or two sharps, obviously, depending on how you want, how you want to run your lineup. If you want to have a sharp rim instead, or a PRM, instead of two pure lockdowns. Um, but yeah, so basically you have two lockdowns in a corner. Two stretches and then post score in the middle. The way you play this is that as soon as somebody pinches, you have a direct pass to a stretch that is wide open. If they rotate, you pass it on a corner and just keep on rotation. It's rotations keep going until you find an open man. Like I said, it forces them to chew between if they want to give me the ISO and see if I can score on their defender or not. Or to pinch down and to risk a dot going out to the three. Now sometimes you catch me off, sometimes I think they're baiting, sometimes I think they're blitzing. So it kind of just depends on where my mindset is at during that time. As they get better at it throughout the whole entire year, then it will become a better system. Chemistry will be better, I don't know how to pass out of it correctly, it'll be good from there. But the reason why I love it so much is because it, it stops fast breaks. Majority of teams have more than half of their points come from fast break possessions only Fast break possessions only How five out stops that is that of a post score if you happen to miss and you say you take a jumper three If I do a step back take it a three wide open in the middle of the court if I miss that shot We have two stretches and one post score Three seven foot or taller builds waiting to stop a fast break, which is gonna be a lot of coverage, especially if somebody R one L ones. We are gonna be right there for a steal. So, how do you implement this into your own system? So, let's say you have someone's very dominant in five out. It doesn't even have to be always five out middle. You can do five out baseline, five out left baseline, five out free throw, five out right hash, left hash. There's lots of combinations you can do, and you guys should run plays out of this alone. Now, keep on if you're running it through a post score, even a sharp rim. If you know how to speed boost and do post step backs, you can really do what I do. Um, like the, the, the switching spins, spinny poos, um, going around using a sharp rim, switching back and forth, speed boosting, step back threes. They're all very good on a sharp rim and sharp rebound or build. If you are a post scorer but you have one of those builds, I would highly recommend using that build unless you're a high overall post scorer for the primary reason that your three point shot is going to be a lot more deadly compared to if you're shot post. Now, when you do do this, there's multiple options that you can score out of this. Back doors, off ball screens, fee fees. We also run a few plays that we do keep secretive as well. That works fantastic um, with this kind of offense. And like I said, um, flashback to, to my boy CB over there. Break that wide open shot. Um, and like I said, as soon as you go take over, it's very easy. You just do drop steps, hop fades, do whatever you want to to score. Um, and that's basically what's been happening throughout the past several weeks. Um, like I said, Twitch is in the description. And f flash, if you enjoy these type of videos, like live commentary type styles, I will definitely be open to this. But I also want to shout out to my team that I have been with the past couple weeks. I am kind of a drama king. I'm, I'm very dramatic. And they've been dealing with me, like I said, for over the past several weeks. We have a few rough points here and there. Understandably, but we are getting there definitely um shout out to um tamari for hitting that shot so like i said if you want to tune in to more of these team prime live streams twitch link is in the description or just let me know in the comments what type of videos do you want to see from me do you enjoy these type of videos where it's team prime focused i can throw some tips here and there and buckets um so i can throw that there and just let me know what kind of videos you want to see do you enjoy these live commentaries do you want to see more like more park videos 
um, like more like comedic videos, serious videos. So let me know what you want to see. If you want to see me stream pro am 24/7. You can say that as well. Um, that will be on Twitch in the description, like I said. And as always, good day, adios, and good night. Peace. And all of you have a fantastic rest of your day. Hey, bloomin' to the end of time, cause I've been really making moves. Only kick it with a few. Money calling coming through. Now they say I'm acting new. Bitches on the by my rule. I'll be